All right, so talking about tension pneumo, remember, these patients not only have absent lung sounds, they might have something called pleuritic chest pain, which was pain on inspiration, inspiration right? Pain on inspiration. Now, just because somebody has absent or diminished lung sounds on one side, does that mean that they are under tension? No. no. They have to have shock. Signs of shock, right? So somebody give me an example of signs of shock. Low 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 yeah, maybe maybe not a low blood pressure. It could be a high heart rate A-mass. with diminished uh, or delayed cap refill, cool failed diaphoretic, maybe some altered mental status. These are all different signs that we're looking for to uh, start to perform a skill. Now, when I'm going to put this needle, is it going to go above or below ribs? Above. above. For what reason? The vascular. So the 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 and nerve endings, right? Nerve endings. So what we do is we're going to be feeling these ribs, and I want you to feel, once you have a rib, we're going to ride up and over the rib, okay? Now, once we start going through, if you are using this circle needle, I want you to always hold the purple. Do not hold the base. What happens is this is a catheter, the needle will start to retract. So we always have to hold up here up top. Now, as I go through the tissue, I'm waiting. Okay, once I know that I'm in, I'm gonna go ahead and slide my catheter down. My needle's gonna come up. Where's that going? Sharp. 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 And now I'm gonna go ahead and burp the chest. 